Numbered. Like you two were when you saved the scriptures. Oh. That's right, the pages of the Doctrine and Covenants. We did oh, it's fine. There was no one else to do it. Oh, hardly. People don't risk their lives. People don't become heroes just because there's no one else to do it. <laughs> I believe I know the story. Um, you see, in Independence, Missouri, we were persecuted just like we are here. Oh, and, uh, and some of the revelations that the Prophet Joseph Smith received from the Lord were written down and sent to the printers. And a mob, a band of the worst characters you've ever seen, broke into the printer. We watched as they broke the windows, smashed the presses, and threw the pages of God's word out the windows. Into the mud and trampled them. And carried them off. We couldn't let them do that. So these girls, oh, brave girls, uh, scooped the scattered pages up out of the street. Quick, Caroline, you have to save the pages. Hey, where those you go! Hey, grab those pages! Go. Come, Come on! Oh, 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 once they were standing almost right on top of us. But they didn't see you. No, the Lord blinded their eyes. And you weren't afraid? Of course we were, but we knew the Lord would protect us. And he did. Of course, of course. he did. You see, for the youth in Nauvoo, it wasn't just a matter of being brave. It was a matter of having faith. Faith that the Lord would watch over us when we we're in danger. And faith to face hard things. Just like you do now, the youth of Zion, Faced hard things. For instance, some people lost family members to death. Some that's even brothers or sisters or parents. That's what happened to George. Yes, George. Will you tell us? Well, uh, my family joined the church in 